Welcome back. A special laundry program in Beloit has received a $4,500 grant from the Green Bay Packers Foundation. We first told you about the Loads to Success program when it started last year. Our Rock County reporter Jenna Middaw tells us how the program has grown this year and how the grant money will help. For some, laundry can seem like a chore, but at Beloit Memorial High School, they're using laundry to help empower students to be independent. Most days, students like Star Whirly keep their hands pretty busy. I do laundry all the time at home, so I like wash clothes and I help people. As a senior, Star leads the charge in the laundry room. I help everybody else in doing laundry. What started as just a small idea for the Loads to Success program last year has grown into a full-fledged laundry service. It's blown up. Students or families who don't have access to a washer or dryer can discreetly bring their clothes to the high school, where the special education students run the show, keeping track of the clothes, folding them, and letting people know when they're clean and ready to go. <laughs> special education teacher Lori Lang estimates her students did nearly 500 loads of laundry last year, giving them life skills and confidence. I now see my students that I've been working with that have struggled so much over the years walking through the high school with their heads held high. Their whole attitude and demeanor has been very much, I can do this. The program has expanded far beyond school walls, and the students now do laundry for a Rockford-based nonprofit that gives clothes to homeless teens. I like to give back to people. Because of that new partnership, the Loads to Success program was awarded a $4,500 grant from the Green Bay Packers Foundation. So that's very exciting to know that, you know, an organization such as that is recognizing what we do down here and trying their best to help us out. With the money, the program hopes to buy more machines to make sure the students can keep up with the loads of laundry as they come in. Right now, the students do the laundry within three different rooms, so Lang hopes to eventually have one designated laundry room for the students to work in. Reporting from the Rock County Bureau, I'm Jenna Middaw for WISC News 3. The Loads to Success program is looking for monetary donations as well as fragrance-free soaps. If you would like to donate, you can find more information on our website, channel3000.com.